um, if you don't know, the New York Times referenced this show when I interviewed C3P Meme. They didn't give the show any credit. But now I know I probably got a CIA agent. Hey, Bob, how you doing? I'm peaceful, man. You better understand something, son. You better understand something. Red wave, bitch. Red, red wave's going to be a red wedding going down January 6th. <laughs> on that day, Trump That's says, my dude, man. show up. YouTube, I'm not saying anything. I'm educating about what happened. This is history now. This is a history lesson. I'm the National Geographic of this bitch, YouTube. What they're saying is, on the civil side of things, not criminal, if you said what Donald Trump said, you could be sued, is what they're setting that precedent for. And they, they could set that precedent for, precedent for any state. Whatever they said Donald Trump said to incite the insurrection, and then uh, maybe a, a Capitol Police officer gets hurt, that Capitol Police officer could sue you. They could sue Salty Crack. You see them, they stagger these, these chess moves. That's why I got to teach my, I think I'm going to get my kid uh, for Christmas, don't tell him, uh, a Super Mario Brothers chess set to kind of make it fun because you know at first he might not know the moves and just move stuff around but um he's played the re real chess it's you know it's a little bit more advanced for him but we haven't spent much time on it but these are chess moves they're linking it together the the FISA stuff then to the j6 and then now to the insurrection and now they're going to link it to influencers anyone so you saw what they did with alex jones they did the same thing to trump did the same thing to giuliani and now it's going to come to you whoever it is i don't want to name somebody in a bad light like that they didn't do anything wrong whatever influencer said anything similar to donald trump guess what they're going to come after you too civil other key trump supporters including far-right media personalities began promoting the wild protest on january 6th it's saturday December so they already went after Alex the Jones. 2020. They played this and in the, the hearing, remember? Events in American history. Remember, this is about two minutes, so I'm going to talk over it. It's not even important. What We know what Alex is saying. I'm just saying they played this in the Senate hearing. They played this clip in the J6 Senate, he I mean Senate um, Congress hearing. And now Donald Trump is calling on his supporters to descend on Washington, D.C., January 6th. He is now. They played Tim Pool reading an article. What was wrong with this? In Colorado, they could sue Tim Pool. Why not? Lawyers tell me tell, tell me where I'm wrong. This was a civil case. They said, oh, this is what insurrection means. Donald Trump wasn't, he didn't go in the Capitol. So Tim Pool didn't go in the Capitol. You saw with how they got Enrique Tario. He wasn't even, uh, he was, was he in DC? I forget, he wasn't even near the Capitol. I forgot if he was out of town or in DC. It doesn't matter where you're at. They're gonna go after uh, these people as well for for saying this. Listen to this. He read an article basically, and he didn't even he he said what Donald Trump was doing. Donald Trump is calling on his supporters to descend on Washington D.C. January sixth. He is that is an insurrection based on color the way Colorado interpreted this. That was insurrection. Now calling on we the people to take action and to show our numbers. We're going to only be saved by millions of- Take action and show your numbers. Donald Trump said, fight for your country. They're coming after all of us. Americans moving to Washington, occupying the entire area, if, if necessary, storming right into the Capitol. You know, there, we, we know the rules of engagement. If you have enough people, you can push down any kind of a fence or a wall. That is all legal speech and obviously not insurrection. They, the left goes through the Capitol all the time. They just went in there with their fake protests over Palestine. Next is, oh, we go to your social media and you said MAGA's last stand. All y'all can get sued. He has specifically called on his supporters to arrive in D.C. That's something that may actually be the big push. Trump supporters need to say this is it. It's now or never. You better understand something, son. You better understand something. Red wave, bitch. Red, red wave's going to be a red wedding going down January 6th. Hey, Trump That's says, my dude, man. Show up for a That's got to be a drop. I don't know if it's going to cause problems with YouTube. Maybe that shouldn't be a drop. <laughs> I'm talking about how they're going to hem all of us up, not criminally, but civilly and on the civil side and i'm like let's make this a drop maybe that's not a good idea the new york times if you don't know referenced the show without giving us credit just like they took stephen ignoramus's cnn took a video from stephen ignoramus didn't give him credit that video has over six million views right now the new york times referenced the show when i interviewed c3p meme they didn't give the show any credit 
But now I know I probably got a CIA agent. Hey, Bob, how you doing? I'm peaceful, man. I if if there is really a CIA CIA agent out there that's assigned, I I'd like to get a brew with you, man, or woman, whatever. And I bet you we'd be cool. It it's now or never. You better understand something, son. You better understand something. Red wave, bitch. red wave. This is gonna be a red wedding. Red wave. This is gonna be a red wedding. Bitch. Red wave. This is gonna be a red. Wedding. I don't understand something. Red YouTube, wave, uh, YouTube. I'm not saying anything. I'm. This is for educational purposes. There's gonna be a red wedding. There's gonna be a red wedding, bitch. Red wedding. This is gonna be a red wedding. <laughs> this is. I'm not. Something. YouTube. I'm not saying anything. I'm educating about what happened. This is history now. This is a history lesson. Think of me a national. I'm the National Geographic of this bitch. YouTube. This isn't. I'm not calling for action. I'm saying, how dare Salty Cracker use such foul language? You better understand something, son. You better understand something. Red wave, bitch. Red wave. This is gonna be a red wedding going down January 6th. On that day, Trump says, show up for a protest, it's gonna be wild. And based on what we've already seen from the- So all those people are in, in, uh, in my opinion, civil danger, and you might see them making moves. Who knows? Get the hell up out of here. Because <laughs> this, this stuff is getting crazy. They're in the next level. They already went to Alex Jones, they went to, Donald Trump, they about wrapped up. They're gonna wrap. They're gonna sign, seal, and deliver Donald Trump. And then they went to Michigan 16, the alternate electors, and now they're gonna go to the, the influencers. Are more important. Remember, Bryson Gray was on the J6 committee hit list. Yeah, the they come in for you next. Motherfuckers, you haven't met us then because we geeked up and crazy and all this nonsense you're throwing in our way. That's motherfucking MAGA fuel as far as we're concerned. We take this stupid shit, we turn that shit into fuel rods, and we use it as motherfucking rocket fuel. Middle MAGA.